we are ready to go just about millions of viewers from all around the world are tuning in for the super cup decider my name is Derek Ray here in the commentary position I'm joined by Stuart Robson and with the atmosphere building to fever pitch we're inching ever closer to kickoff time it is Manchester United facing Manchester City well I have to say Derek I'm really looking forward to this both these sides did so well to win their respective cups I think this should be close tonight The lineup for Manchester United. Davy De Gea stands between the posts. Rafael Varane plays alongside Harry Maguire in central defence. Bruno Fernandes plays alongside Scott McTominay in midfield. And the starting role in attack is handed to Cristiano Ronaldo. Introducing the starting players for Manchester City. Ederson gets the nod in goal. Joao Cancelo starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Rodri in central midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. In the battle for the UEFA Super Cup, they're underway now. And a fine tackle. Oh, good vision. Ronaldo. Well, placement over power, but it didn't work out for him. De Bruyne Foden Grealish Oh surely He knows he's got to react It did look on for them but not to be You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it Booking to come you would think we're going to see the first yellow card of the game. The referee not standing on ceremony. Well, he's under pressure now. It's a long time to be on a booking. Ronaldo. On to Bruno Fernandes. And he's in. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. On they go again. A wake-up call for the City players, maybe. Can they find a response now?
Mason Greenwood. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Diogo Dallo. Chance to play it in. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Over the touchline for a throw in. Scott McTominay. Deflected behind, corner forthcoming. Who's going to get on the end of it? On the corner, far too close to the goalkeeper. Well, at first glance, you would think a strong possibility of a red card. Let's see. And this ordering off could mean the end of their push today. Well, there's no way back now. He's really let his teammates down here. Tidy on the ball. Now can they counter clinically? And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Joao Cancelo. Jack Grealish. Really good interception. Ronaldo. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. McTominay. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Grealish. United come away with it. It's with Alex Tennis. Scott McTominay. Fred. Ronaldo. Tremendous challenge. Well, the counter chance looks very real. De Bruyne. Well, as you can see, United just haven't been able to dictate the pace of the game. But when they have had it, they've looked so dangerous, particularly when they press high up the field, win the ball back in those areas, and then counter-attack quickly. Ruben Diaz. On to Silva. De Bruyne. Over the top in the direction of Gabriel Jesus. Sloppy in possession from City. So a goal kick is what's coming up here. Well, we've almost reached the halfway mark here. Manchester United on top. Stuart, interested to get your thoughts so far. Yes, they've defended really well all over the pitch. Their work rate and discipline has been excellent. But any drop in tempo and this lead could easily slip away. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. 
Well, no let up, plenty of pressure. De Bruyne. Gabriel Jesus prepared to fire. Well, couldn't find a teammate, unfortunately. And a throw in to come. Into the advanced position. He's taken on his opponent here. Well, then there to tidy up. Walker. On to Jesus. Oh, big chance. And De Gea, absolutely brilliant goalkeeping. So two minutes to be added on at the end. Well, not the pass he had in mind. Counter attacking, very much an option. And so it is, the first half story has been written. And the second half in this UEFA Super Cup tussle is underway here. Cristiano Ronaldo. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. Grealish. A oh, terrific pass. Just couldn't capitalise there. Bruno Fernandes. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Ronaldo threading it through. Oh, magnificent reaction. Playing it in. Well, still an issue here. Threat over for now, it seems. Room to roam for City on the wing. Taking care of business defensively here. So a throw in here. Scott McTominay. Harry Maguire now. Well, a decent idea, but just slightly overcooked. Ronaldo at the ready. It comes to absolutely nothing. More than decent this from United. But nothing comes of it. Alex Tevez. now and the lead fully merited well that was a fairly easy finish in the end but he still had to take it he won't mind how they come though change for Manchester United so 2-0 now Gabriel Jesus 
He's done remarkably well to get himself forward here. Gabriel Ge And keeper's ball. He made it look as though it was never in any doubt. Scott McTominay. Shaw. Maguire. Well, they keep passing away. Pulls it back. And a penalty awarded. Spot kick coming up. Well, that is what they didn't need to lose a player in this fashion. Well, what can you say about that? What was going through his mind? And the spot kick is converted as calmly as you like. Well, here's the replay, and he just strikes the ball down the middle. The goalkeeper gets out of the way. It's a really good penalty, and no danger that the goalkeeper is going to save that. So on with the game again, United in charge, the scoreline threatening to get ugly. Kevin De Bruyne. Excellent ball over the top. Shot attempted. Well, flinging himself up the ball. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. And over it comes. A really sound goalkeeping. Well, that's such a good save, isn't it? How did he keep that one out? A change on the offing for City. Let's see about the delivery. And just the header that was required. The goal they were in search of. Well, here you can see it again. It's a superb cross, just asking for someone to go and meet it. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. No shortage of goals on this match. 3-1. 20 minutes to go in this one. Diogo Dallo moving the ball forward with purpose. Cross could be useful, but goalkeeper's ball, disappointingly for them. Joao Cancelo. Given away by City. A bit sloppy in possession. Incision with the pass from Kevin De Bruyne. Mares. And a crisp effort just over the top. And Manchester City will go to their bench.
Bruno Fernandes. Useful looking ball. And that's the hat trick. Tearing apart this defence time and again. They simply can't handle him. Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect, but there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plum. It's a great goal. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Well, he's got plenty of space on the flank here. Oh, he's blocked it! Here's a change for Manchester United. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, he was under a bit of pressure, but he'll feel he should have done a bit better with the header. Well, as we approach full time in this one, Stuart, no escaping the conclusion that United are bossing this. Well, what can you say about this performance? They've been absolutely brilliant. They've played with such guile and creativity, and their passing has been so expansive. Not many teams would have stopped them today. Oh, good play, this. Into the middle from Bernardo Silva. Making sure nothing untoward happened. And making use of his physical strength to hang on to it. Mares. Oh, terrific save. Well, you're absolutely right. That's a top-class save. Just look how he reacts. A change in the offing for City. And there's the delivery. And an effective clearance. Joao Cancelo. The pass could do damage. Ronaldo. Well, he didn't miss by all that much. Well, he struck it quite nicely, but the keeper was always in control of the situation. He knew that was going wide. Gundogan, Riyad Mahrez, Mahrez, Cancelo, and there it is, a goal, but will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings, they haven't been at the best. Well here's the replay and he shows great awareness to play this through ball and there's certainly no doubt about the finish, he really hits it with power and accuracy, nothing the keeper can do about that. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Well, you can absolutely sense the frustration growing in the opposition camp. They can't get near the ball. Shaw. He continues his run. Ronaldo at the ready. Well, dealt with that ball comfortably. Matic. Happy to take on the shot. And that, a piece of goalkeeping, you're going to see again and again and again. Can someone get on the end of this? 
smuggled away. And full time, most satisfying a victory in the curtain raiser to the season. Well, it's certainly a good way to start the season. That's just what they wanted. They played really well today, and it's always great to keep winning trophies. First piece of silverware, and that is never to be sniffed at as the players applaud the fans who have been backing them today. Well, it's great preparation for the season, Derek, and this is always a nice moment going up to lift any trophy. Great for those fans as well. Now for the trophy lift. And with friends and family in attendance, you've always got to really savour these moments when they come around, Stuart. Well, they've got to enjoy this, Derek, and then get ready for a tough season ahead. They won't be celebrating too much tonight. Absolutely, Stuart. They all know the show must go on after this. And now the players posing for the images that will be sent around the world. Well, these are great moments, aren't they? Certainly ones to cherish, and there will more of this come the end of the season.